All right, we back. What's up, guys? Trying to see if everything sounds good. Um, how does this sound for you guys? Is it too um, too low or is it fine? One up two. What's up, dude? Evane Cut West. Just Tsushima, what's up? Vapor Dex, what's going on? Welcome back. I'm the Tilt, what's up, dude? Oh boy. Wonder what will they show today? No character trailers? Oh man, that sucks. Well, I guess we will see. Okay, we back. <laughs> what's up, Elder God Fist? Il Tubo, what's up? <laughs> All right, fifteen seconds left. Let's get it. Are oh, they turning up the volume? <laughs> All right, what we got? What we got? Let's go. Oh my god. Oh, that's that Tekken 8 music. Thank you, JC King. Welcome. Let's see what they got for us. Hello everyone! Honditsuwa Tokyo Game Show 2023 Bandai Namco Entertainment Booth Yokoso Okoskurasaimashita. Koko Kara no stage wa Tekken Talk Live at TGS 2023 wo Okrishtai to moimas. Welcome to the Tokyo Game Show 2023 Bandai Namco Entertainment Booth. It is now time for the Tekken Talk Live at TGS 2023。このステージではですね、鉄拳8と上達への道をテーマとしまして、バトルに関する心情報をたくさんお伝えしてまいります。私本日の司会進行を進めさせていただきます。水口俊介と申します。どうぞ最後までお付き合いください。with the theme Tekken 8, the road to proficiency, we'll be sharing new and juicy information about the battles here on this stage. I am Shu Mizubuchi, your host for today, and please be sure to stay with us till the very, very end because we have so much, so much to share with you, share with you until the very last second. Okay. また本日は英語圏にを皆様に向けても配信を行っております。Today's broadcast is also available for English speaking countries. Please note that the game description will all be shown in English. Oh, okay. So, it was a great day. Take care of the project member. This is so much Please better. Welcome the amazing members of Tekken Project. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Busy, yo. Thank you. I'm glad. I'm honored. Hi. どうもどうもどうも。続きまして、テッケン8プロデューサー、マイケルムレイ。マイケルムレイプロデューサーオブテッケン8。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケ
Now, I haven't, I, I touched Mortal Kombat a, a little bit, like five minutes before I had to go, but I haven't streamed it yet. <laughs> so we actually have some footage to show you for the story mode. Uh, it's the first time we're showing it here at, at TGS, so uh, please check it out. Next movie. Oh, story mode footage. Let's go. Oh, Lars. I can't hear it. That looks great. Oh, look at Kazuya. He's a boss. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was dope. Yo, thank you, Doc Green. I got you, bro. I got you, Doc. That's right. I forgot. Jin is the... Yeah, he was a bad guy in Tekken 6, right? And <laughs> Kazuya called him out on it. That's cool. Oh, that's dope. Look at Kazuya. So as you can see, uh, if you go from the sea, you go straight into the battle. Nice. And as you can see, the special style is now enabled. So he's using specialty mode. Wow, you get quite a bit. And as you can see, by just simultaneously pressing the button, when the special style is enabled, you can do all kinds of cool uh, attacks like this. That is crazy. One button hail sweep. Yeah, the future is here. That was the most meager explosion from such a big missile. Nah, that was cool. Yeah, that is crazy. Yeah, because when I was playing with the um, modern mode, well, specialty mode, yeah, you could just hit the circle button. You hit four, and King would do four, four, neutral, two. You wouldn't need to do the, the you know, the four, four, neutral part. He just did it. Don't forget, Jim was the bad guy in Tekken 6. Because he wanted to um, get rid of Azazel. Yeah, that special style is uh, something else. That's going to help beginners learn Tekken, right? 
これ本当見せたのは本当に本当の一部です。あの、すごい長いストーリーがyeah, they're doing a way with hard inputs. Even in arcade style. Yeah, I'm gonna play store mode this time too, Daper. Sub Army. So what you just saw was only just start, uh, a slight part of the actual overall story. Uh, there's really a lot there to enjoy once you see the final product. Uh, and for those of you who maybe think that uh, I don't know the story from Tekken 1 through 7, uh, we have you covered because there's going to be uh, footage from past games to let you know what the story is like. Uh, and we put it in gallery to make it easy to consume and to check it out. Uh, but not just that. Cool, uh, cool. Maybe many people don't know. Uh, Tekken has several Guinness records. Uh, one of them is actually for the story. So it has the longest running video game story. Not just fighting games, but video game story. Uh, so that's quite impressive. That is quite uh, impressive. Yeah, so I was thinking Final Fantasy or something, I don't know. But that story always changes, doesn't it? Thank you, Doc Green. Yeah, Fang Wei has the drip. And he's really strong. Yeah, for sure. Diablo Jim, what's up, dude? So, uh, Harada, I think we have uh, some more details about that as well. Uh, and the answer is, uh, yes, we do. So not only do we have the main overarching story that contains all the characters for the main story, but there's also little uh, character episodes that kind of show you what's going on uh, this time for each of the individual characters as well. So uh, there's quite a lot of volume there, and we think that you'll enjoy it. Wow, that is great. Did you guys just hear that? All, the, all of the characters are going to be in the story mode this time. And side things, like character episodes. Yeah, right here. Mm. Yo, look at this Steve picture. He has all the titles. You can check out the character episodes. We have one for each of all 32 characters. So when you play through this and you clear that particular episode, uh, you'll be rewarded with a uh, footage, uh, a movie for each of those characters. So it should be quite entertaining. That looks really dope. <laughs> Lily and Azucena. Tea versus coffee. So there you go. I think that's uh, the best way to proceed in the game for uh, people who are new to the game uh, is to play through the story uh, while you're learning the controls and to check out the character episode. Yeah, I think most of the casual players are going to just probably stick with the, you know, the, the specialty style. What do you guys think? And then you can also get used to the game through uh, playing by the special style. Thank you very much. では続きましてさっそく次の質問に行きたいんですけれども、やはりですね、従来の操作方法であるアーケードスタイルをやっぱり勉強したいという人も多いと思います。このアーケードスタイルの基礎知識、基礎知識やテクニックを学ぶには、
Yeah, it looks a lot better, like with the most recent footage. That stuff looks really good. Arcade Quest. What's up, Ace God? What's up? So we'd like to tell you about a brand new mode uh, for Tekken 8 being the Arcade Quest. So what this is is you create an avatar and you'll be uh, exploring the arcade that's kind of modeled after 90s arcade scenes and culture. So as you do this, you'll have uh, several friends that'll accompany you as well as uh, Max, who is kind of your guide on this journey as you progress through different arcades. さっき最初に見せたメインストーリーの長いストーリーモードのストーリーとあとキャラごとのエピソードのストーリーっていうのがあってさらにこういうプレイヤーサイドのプレイヤーモードもあるとまあ大きく言うと三つねストーリーがあ
uh, and gradually using those skills against your opponents uh, to level up as a player. Oh, they're in rage. Watch out. I like that prompt. That's and cool. If you forget, like if you're in rage, uh, Max will be like, hey, you have rage. Why don't you use it? That's dope. That will definitely remind the casual players, you know, the beginners. Rage is important and you have to use it. So you can kind of get that feeling that many of us had in the arcade where you have a friend behind you who's giving you advice as you're playing uh, to be a better player. Thank you. Yeah, this tutorial <laughs> is going to create a bunch of mashers. <laughs> Friend <laughs> in the arcade. But it's cool though. It's cool. <laughs> Maximum powers. What's up, bro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 ありがとうございます。はい、とりあえずそれはですね、続きましてスーパーゴーストバトルについてお伺いたいと思います。このスーパーゴーストバトル具体的にどういった特徴がありますでしょうか。それ、ライターアスクアルベナバーとスーパー
We have like a, a ghost battle or something. I wonder if that's possible. I wonder if they're going to answer that. All right, later, say it's come. It's interesting how you actually come to like your ghosts quite a bit and you feel attached to them. Uh, and you want to prove it as a player just so that your ghost levels up. So it really is a lot of fun to play this mode. Yeah, like Ghost Against Ghost. It really motivates you, this Spur Ghost battle really motivates you to become a better player. So it'd be like, <laughs> yo, poke chop, let's do a, a ghost money match. I bet my ghost can beat yours in the first of five. So wait one second, that was just a little bit. <laughs> it'd be crazy. We want to show you actually what ghost gambling. Yeah. Not the best of ideas, right? <laughs> yo, does Paul have the? Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, so the ghost is Ben Ben. Doing the follow up to slide. Uh, he's really going for launchers. So you can see uh, someone on our dev team actually created this ghost, and their strategy here is to mix uh, mid attacks and low attacks. Yeah, no punishment though. で、注目してもらいたいのはやっぱり移動周り、左手の操作部分だったり、ま、とっさのアドリブ含めたコンボの精度などが今までの鉄拳のゴーストとははるかに進化したことが分かると思います。Some points to check out is the movement is much more player like for the ghost. And not only that, but um ad-lib combos where you just uh suddenly uh float your opponent and just uh on the fly make up a combo. That's something this ghost has actually been able to pick up. Really? Quick float combos? Okay. That's actually OD. So it really actually feels like you're playing a human opponent. Uh, and as such, it helps you play or uh, prepare for other uh, human opponents as well. <laughs> Trying so your really ghost. A great mode, and we're excited about this one. こういう本当瞬間的な浮きに対してもアドリブでコンボを決めるっていうここまでかなり高度なことをやってます。Yeah, he just did a float right there. He just did a float combo. To go straight into a combo. You can see how intelligent the the ghost is. That's good stuff, though. Hmm. So this means you can never really not find a match. You can fight a ghost. That's actually great. But can you do a ghost versus ghost? ま、絶対できないことを動画に収めてきたので、そこご注目ください。自分と戦うってことだよね。そうなんですよね。はい。So this shows where you can actually download him, huh? I got this many downloaded ghosts. He said Mishima star. That's super old school. Say fantasy football. Yeah, fantasy Tekken, right? Yeah, Mishima Starship whip him. 
実際本人は右ライトサイドのプレイヤーで左側がゴーストキャラクターになります特にあの細かいサイドステップを1回挟んだりとか。See, I'm looking for will punishment. Oh, hell sweet. Oh, goodness. And you'll notice the ghost even does slight like side steps and movement adjustments, just like right now. Hi, so, on a kind of honto ni honin no, eh, to kse da ta li yoku skau technique to kichi li saigen shi kure no de, taisen shi te monosoku kamoshi de. So you can see the ghost will soon pick up all of your characteristics, the moves you use the most. Any kind of like uh, movement uh, characteristic wow. you have. So it's really fun to battle against your own ghost. I'm just trying to see like a, a whiff punish from the ghost, but then I'll be sold. I will be sold. Oh my goodness, he ducked and did launched. Okay. Wow. Oh boy. That was actually the ghost that uh, ducked and then with punish, so pretty impressive. Well, not only more, Hontoni, who is my sort of a serious son of ghost of a dekir to Tyson Suto, but it must be the Hontoni Tsuk, Tsuk, the mine. Oh, look at the, the movement of the ghost. Wow. So you can actually tell how strong the original player is just by fighting their ghost and how impressive it is. Yo, the real Mishima star is getting clapped by his ghost here. Okay. Wow, look at the lack of tracking on down back four. <laughs> the Mishima star is actually, uh, his back was against the wall during this match. <laughs> Ah, it's a little late on the whip punish there. Okay. Yo, so they they left that string for Kazuya. That's crazy. How much pros get per download? It's gonna all be free. Uh, okay, and that's it for the Super Ghost Battle footage. I didn't know that the Arcade Quest was not the ghost of the That's a very good feature. I didn't know that the ghost of the ghost was not the ghost of the ghost. I didn't know that the ghost of the ghost was not the ghost of the ghost. I didn't know that the ghost of the ghost was not the ghost of the ghost. I didn't know that the ghost of the ghost was not the ghost of the ghost. And actually, you can fight uh, ghosts in the arcade quest that we were just talking about. Uh, and if you progress far enough and you fulfill the conditions, you can fight against uh, my ghost or Nakatsu or Harada as well. So check it out. We really power up. We'll be able to play the ghost of these three wonderful players. Developers too, huh? Yeah, you're going to get Harada. The next question is, how can a beginner enjoy the Tekken Fight Lounge, which is a large online visual lobby? Please tell us about it. Yes, I will ask you to ask the next slide. So we'll dive into the explanation now. So let's bring up the next slide. Next slide, please. So those are the areas, okay, okay. Four, four big areas. <laughs> they misspell customization. It's all good. It's all good. 
Uh, so good. So I got a battle arena. So Tekken Fight Lounge so there's a lot of cool stuff in the battle area, uh, as you can see, is kind of modeled after arcade. So it's a very nice uh, online place to hang out with other players and interact with them. And uh, we have some footage so you can get a better idea of what it looks like. So next video, please. Okay, okay, this is the footage we saw. Yeah, this was actually really good. So this is what it looks like. You'll see all these different players with uh, various customizations uh, wandering around. You think Tekken's lounge is better than Street Fighter? It could be. I just don't like the little chibi characters, but other than that, looks really swell. And up to a hundred people can join the same lobby. A hundred people? Wow. まあ、ここではそのカスタマイズのアイテムを購入したり、自分がキャラクターのカスタマイズや like the customization room. That's customization dope. items that you can purchase. Uh, and also you can change in and, and uh, change into different items with your avatar. ここは結構開発中やっぱ作るときに <laughs> My character's gonna be a pimp. <laughs> Probably. So we wanted people to want to come back every day uh, online to not only interact with their friends, but to check out uh, all the different cool customization items we have. So the the music, the atmosphere, all this stuff is uh, made to be more exciting and uh, make you want to come back and, and see it every day. Every day, they're trying to take your life. That's great. Make you want to play more Tekken. During the peak of the 80s and the 90s, as inspiration for the design. Yeah, people are. Yeah, people are totally going to be playing this every single day. I'm people. And not just arcades, you know, uh, all three of us have been to Evo quite often, so uh, some of the atmosphere of that or some of the kind of exciting uh, atmospheres you see in the, the casinos, etc. in Vegas uh, is also in the mix for this. Really? NATO, what's up, dude? こうやってビジュアル化して知り合いとか、so rather than just communicating with people over voice or text, we really want to create this atmosphere for people to come online and hang out with their friends uh, and make it feel uh, as similar as possible to the real thing. Uh, and we think uh, what yeah, if it the works quite well. TV has TWT on it in game? What, what do you mean? Like it actually. And there's uh, emotes as well, which you can use to communicate with other players. You mean like if it actually shows a live TWT event? Streaming up, that would be, that would be next level. If they did that. That would be next level. So I heard that mode you miss arcades i do too uh, gamer by i do fans. too it's coming back at the tech and fight lounge please tell us about the mode oh this must be tech and ball mode ah, i got excited the mode so yeah the mode is uh something that people not only have fans been asking for for quite some time but Nakata himself, uh, before he joined the team, he played this mode so often and thought if he ever had the chance, he wanted to try this again. So uh, let's see the footage. Uh, oh, so Tekken Ball. So there you go. Uh, this is really a great really mode, really though. 
マハラさんがすごく。ブリーモード。なあ。ある場所で。あの昔。怖い。やいや。鉄拳ボール。Yeah, yeah. のビーチボールのミニゲームをやって。オンライン上でコミュニケーションをとって。楽しんでほしいと思って、こういったエリアとモードを用意しました。So, Tekken Ball, as you can see,、uh, if you played in the past, is kind of set in a beach environment. And this itself is also an extension of、uh, the online lobby we're showing you. And、uh, we really put a lot of effort into making this very、uh, open and airy、uh, and a place to just kick back and relax、uh, as a, a great place to, to do the Tekken Ball. And there it is, you guys see. So now we have some footage.、Uh, online. Movie, please. It's online. キャラクターちょっと鉄拳3にいたキャラを鉄拳3っぽくアレンジしてみましたボールにダメージを与えてそのボールを、えー、と食らってしまったり自分のボールを食らってしまったりそういったミニゲームになります。Looks just like Paul's. Different than、uh, battles where you don't、uh, directly attack your opponents. You attack the ball,、uh, which、uh, again concurs damage. And、uh, if you hit your opponent with the ball,、uh, it can do damage to them. Or on, on the other hand, if you drop the ball on your court in, in such a manner, then you'll receive damage. Yeah, this is great. This is great because you can do something else other than playing against people in rank. What if they have a rank for this? That would be OD, right? <laughs> That would be crazy. The Tekken Ball champ. I got the highest rank in Tekken Ball mode. Tekken Ball Omega? <laughs> yeah, K Bean, yeah. マッチングしてできますし、あとオフラインでもできるので、あの大会とかのイベントのサイドトーナメントとかで遊んだりもできます。So this can play,、uh, be played online against other people or with your friends offline. So if you wanted to, you can actually have like some kind of a side tournament just playing Tekken Ball. Yeah, they are like champions of Tekken Ball mode. これね、昔僕が鉄拳3の時に、本当は空中コンボを練習するモードを作ろうとして、失敗してビーチバレーになっちゃったんですよ。Paul is a great character for Tekken Ball mode. I think he's the best, right? Back in the day, create a mode that teaches you how to do aerial juggles.、Uh, but he messed up and it turned into this kind of beach volleyball game.、Uh, but it actually turned out quite well. There was some great new footage of, of the Tekken Ball mode. Now's one more mode that we want. Just take a break if you're kind of、uh, frustrated or tired from the,、um, the pressure of online battles.、Uh, so just kick back and relax with your friends.、Uh, but it also. Take him ball of prime. Timing and what kind of techniques you might want to use in battles as well.、Uh, so it serves、uh, both purposes. That's all for the explanation on Tekken Ball. ありがとうございます。Thank you very much. もうここまででも結構お腹いっぱいでてんこ盛りの状況で、ね、まだまだ続きます。Team Battle was great. It was fun too. 休憩を取りたいと思います。テケントークライブ at TGS 2023まだまだまだまだ続きますのでどうぞ皆さん引き続きお付き合いください。So we had a lot of information so far, but this talk live will continue. We'll now take a 10 minute break. Tech and Talk Live at TGS 2023 will continue, so stay tuned and we'll see you all、uh, later. They have in more. Thank you. Wow, that is, that is interesting. I thought that was going to be it. So they have more. Hmm. So I wonder what more will they have for us? I did hear them right. Right? They said more tech and talk, right? Yeah, that, that would be great if、um, they surprise us with something. Because, you know, people have been just getting like 
the leak it's you know leak after leak after leak after leak so nothing is a surprise anymore so hopefully today will be a great day to like really be surprised chrono mad yo thank you thank you welcome yeah we got some more on the way we just got a 10 minute break and um hopefully they can wow us with some more footage stream two days ago for fang way day fang way day yeah i mean i i had i had a great time playing taken seven when uh when was the last time I streamed it? I think I was playing against GM, a long set. It was pretty fun after like not playing it for three months, but uh, yeah, it was still pretty fun. Thanks for the shout out to Chrono Mad, Elder Godfist, and Fizzy. You're down for Leech Holland? Yeah. Yeah, I can't wait to see what he looks like and like what new additions they gave him. See if they give them a better rage art. We need DOA cross Tekken ASAP. They're doing they yo. Maybe if they have like guest characters or something from DOA or like Virtual Fighter, I would not be mad at that. But I know that's not how things work. So um, yeah. You think Julia will be on? Yeah, I think she will. Some kind of way. What's up, Squeaks? Long time no see, bro. They just showed us the, uh, like, a little bit of the Tekken story mode and the arcade quest, Tekken ball mode. All the stuff, you know, the special style controls. All the stuff to help uh, beginners learn the game, even like the tutorial and the uh, the ghost battle AI stuff. Yeah, they showed a lot. They showed a lot. Yeah, this is actually going to be the best Tekken for a beginner, like a beginner beginner, because they have the little characters telling you stuff you should do, man. Those little prompts on the screen. Yeah, that's some great stuff. Wolf from... <laughs> I would love... I would love to have Wolf from Virtual Fighter on this game. That would be great. You want Gon and Alex and Roger back? I know um, you and um, Squeaky definitely want Roger, but um, I'm like, whatever. I play King, so, you know, he's he's got a lot of their moves and more, so um, I'm good. Virgil would be a cool guess. Virgil? That's a little bit much. You said King looks more like a wrestler than Wolf? <laughs> you said, will Snake make it this time? <laughs> oh no. Omega Tekken has every original character. Well, we had tag two. And you see how that turned out. I don't think so, Tech Davis. This King is pretty um pretty strong this time around. He was pretty strong at Tekken 7 too, so yeah, I don't know. Maybe Zafina if 
if she's still on that like horrible hurt boxes and all that stuff again but I doubt it Bake the grappler I would much prefer Yujiro over Baki. I'd rather have Yujiro than Baki. Or Lu would be a great guest character. <laughs> AKA Chad Free. up brutal splinter oh you're g leviathan oh okay okay welcome back welcome back i hope king will still have the infinite tail spin you talking about the infinite uh um, lariat that was a quick 10 minutes they had Negan now Daryl turn. <laughs> oh my goodness. It'll probably be Maggie's turn. I heard she's a boss on the new um, Walking Dead. Pickle. <laughs> yeah, they'll probably, I don't know what they're gonna do with guest characters if they even have them. But I know Harada was like, we gotta work on the original characters first. So, um, there is no telling, but I'm sure they're going to do something. I just don't know who, like, what's the most popular thing out right now that could have like a guest character in Tekken? Miss Elden Ring? <laughs> What if they put Pinocchio on the game from Liza P? Mortal Kombat. Well, they do have Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter, but I don't know. I don't know if they're going to do that again. 2D characters. Feels like they, what's that, DOA? Hasn't gotten the love it should lately. Yo, that's on the um, who who develops them? Is it is it Tech McCoy? Yeah, they gotta do something. Koi, yeah, yeah, Koi, yeah, they need yeah, they need to do something with their franchise. What's up, Mankey King? They better reveal Devil Gen. They did earlier. You know, the story mode stuff. Probably not Chris Redfield. Probably not. Man said Godzilla. Oh, no. No <laughs> Robocop, oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. What else do they have for us, chat? John Wick. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what we got? What we got? That's a dope theme song. Hello everyone! From the first trailer. Bandai Namco Entertainment Booth, Yokozo, Okoskurasai Mashita. 
鉄拳トークライブアット TGS2023 ここからは後半戦をお送りしたいと思います Welcome to the Tokyo Game Show 2023 Bandai Namco Entertainment Booth You're joining us as we begin the second half of Tekken Talk Live at TGS 2023 このステージでは「鉄拳エイト上達への道」をテーマとしましてバトルに関する新情報をお届けしております。改めて本日の司会進行を務めます水口俊介です。With the theme Tekken 8, The Road to Proficiency, we'll be sharing new information about the battles here at this stage. Once again, I'm your host, Shun Mizabuchi. また本日は英語圏に向けても配信を行っております。日本語、英語への翻訳、そしてゲーム画面の説明文が英語で記載されます旨、ご了承ください。Today's broadcast will be also available for English speaking countries.Please note that the game screen explanations and descriptions will be shown in English. さあ、そして素晴らしい鉄拳プロジェクトのメンバーをご紹介します。We're so、fortunate. Here with me are the wonderful members of the Tekken Project. テケンプロジェクトエグゼクティブプロデューサー原田勝弘、勝弘原田エグゼクティブプロデューサーオブテケンプロジェクト。はいどうも皆さんこんにちは。そしてテケンエイトプロデューサーマイケルムレイ、パンダムプロデューサーオブテケンエイト。Hello everyone 皆さんこんにちは。そしてテケンエイトゲームディレクター池田康平です。康平池田ゲームディレクターオブテケンエイト。はい、えー、皆さんこんにちは、テッケイとゲームディレクターの池田です。よろしくお願いします。さあというわけで引き続きテッケイとの盛りだくさんの情報を皆さんにお送りしてまいります。So on to more juicy information about Tekken 8. どうぞ皆さんお書きください。Please take your seats. さあ前半戦に続きましてこの後半戦でも、えー、これからテッケイとプレイする方、はい、プレイしたい方。えー、初心者の方々に向けて、まあ、どうやって「テケンエイト」を、えー、プレイしていくかどうやって進めていくか、えー、後半戦ではもうちょっと込み入ったもうちょっとアドバンスなお話を聞いていた,いきたいと思います。So like the、uh, first half and the latter half of this talk live,、um, I'm sure there are a lot of people who are just starting t e k e n e i g h t who are hoping to buy t e k e n e i g h t who wants to play t e k e n e i g h t but not yet have. On behalf of those people, I'll be asking more questions about how to play Tekken 8 and how to become a better player with Tekken 8. というわけで、えー、続きましての質問でございます。Tekken Fight Lounge でプレイ可能なオンラインバトルの種類についてお聞かせください。So, what types of battles are available to play online at the Tekken Fight Lounge? はい、えー、こちら、えー、先ほどご紹介しましたけども具体的にどんなことができるかを紹介します。次のスライドお願いします。So we talked a little bit about Tekken Fight Lounge, but、uh, we're going to go into more detail. はい、えー、Tekken Fight Lounge のオンラインバトルは、Group Quick Ranked、えー。普通に段位などを気にせずに、And you can sit in there and spectate. マッチというものと、そのゲームセンターのような、cool. 筐体、あの対面の筐体だったりグループを。使った筐体を使ったグループマッチっていうものとあとはランクマッチ主にできるのはこの3種類の、えー、試合形式になります。So there are actually three different battle types that you can do in the、uh, Tekken Fight Lounge. One of them would be、uh, quick match. This is for people who don't want to lose their rank or to have any kind of movement,、uh, just to have fun. <laughs> the shade. There's also a group match where、uh, there's a, a bunch of arcade machines and、uh, They're separated into groups, so you can find more people in your same group. And then there's also rank match,、uh, which many of you are familiar with. You fight against opponents,、uh, and your rank can actually change accordingly. Also, online match, in the middle of the day, the Zen Hansen, the Omise, the Tekken Ball, the Mitch Online, the Dekirun, the Hi. Well, and、uh, if we're talking about online battles, then I guess we should include Tekken Ball. That's another、uh, option we have to play against people online. Yes, of course, it's not just a fight, but it's a game center. He is, right? Diablo? Yeah, he started off with the savagery. But、uh, like an arcade, especially in the game center, it's not just about playing yourself. It's not just about playing yourself. It's not just about playing yourself. You can actually、uh, stand behind other people and spectate their matches. Man said, You're scared to lose your rank, you play 
So you can actually watch people play and be like, oh, that's an interesting player. Maybe I should play them next. Or maybe uh, this person's about the, the right skill level for me. Maybe I should uh, try a battle with them. They showed a bunch of footage of I'm that boy, but no trailer. Uh, just like the arcades, uh, if you've been to one before, uh, you can kind of see there's a lot of players in the background uh, who are uh, just spectating, and that's actually quite enjoyable in itself. Yeah, ranked is pretty dead on Tekken 7, like, regardless of the console. Not only watching them battle, you can also look at a player's profile, which shows you uh, various things about them, including their various uh, skill rankings, etc. Hmm, that's dope. So it's, it's just like Street Fighter. And we won't be going to much detail on it now, but uh, you can actually customize your own profile. Uh, so we'll have details about that at a later date. Yeah, that's pretty dope. And that's it uh, for the explanation on online battle. Yo, Aru with the big raid. Yo, thank you, Aru. Shout outs to Aru. Yo, thank you. Elder God Fist already on it. So you just mentioned uh, playing rank party match, animals. Uh, okay, now. okay. Does the rank match system differ from that of uh, Tekken 7? Yeah, we're looking at some Tekken 8 stuff. I know Aru loves some Tekken, so yeah. This is a great watch. Great info. So now we have a slide prepared to explain a little bit about the rank match in Tekken 8. I need to take my camera off. Hold up. So you guys can read this. No infinite rematch. Best of three. So some of these details. First off, just like uh, the uh, CNT, you could continually uh, rematch your opponent in ranked. Uh, we made some changes to this uh, for Tekken 8 uh, to make sure that it's fair uh, ranking system. Uh, we limited it to best of three. Oh, thank you, Aru. I hope you had a great stream as well. Yeah, it's been, it's been chill as usual. It's been very chill. Yeah, the also, the number of ranks that we have this time is uh, at 30 compared to 37 for Tekken 7. Uh, and there's several reasons for this. Uh, one is that we wanted to compact the uh, group a little bit and have people of a close skill level on work group together, uh, as this actually affects uh, matching uh, when you're matching against other players. Uh, not just that, though. We've actually brought back some uh, ranks uh, from past Tekken installments that people really liked, uh, while adding some new ones for Tekken 8. Yeah, I wonder if they'll have like the Shihan rank or like Lone Wolf from Tekken 5. That'd be dope. Yeah, I had that same problem, Aru. A lot of us did. Like, could not put Tekken 7 back in. It's <laughs> tough. Earlier on, to the CNT, I believe, um, just to reiterate that up until the yellow ranks, uh, your your rank doesn't go down. So it. it It'll stay the same or go up depending on the outcome of the matches. Okay. Damn ranks are not lowered. Regardless of how much you lose. Okay. Okay. All right. And while you're waiting to match uh, an opponent, we have several things that you can do. Uh, kind of a warming up uh, space in which we've added more features from practice that you can uh, enjoy while you're doing that. Uh, not only that, but Tekken 8 has a feature where you can uh, register friends or rivals, someone you have your eye on that you think is a, a good uh, person to defeat in the future, etc. Uh, you can actually see results of the, those uh, friends and rivals uh, at that time. You can make a rival? Yo, Memphis Legends with the raid. Yo, thank you, brother. Yo, shout out to Memphis Legends. You guys go and follow him. 
Party of 13. Hope you had a great stream, bro. I think you were playing Apex, right? More interesting than my sound at first because it kind of I know I saw you on that earlier. Are you playing Mortal Kombat? Oh, okay, okay. Because as you can see in real time, uh, updates on their progress, it makes you want to, to get even What up, Grand Kataro? My <laughs> face is shiny. Ryoku. I know I look a little yellow, don't I? ね、あの対戦ゲーム、ま、全般にやることかもしれないんですが、こういうランクマッチでこう負け続けてしまうと、どうしてもこうやる気が。That's very interesting. モチベーションが下がってしまうという。With the rank. ま、そういった方、お悩みの方に向けて、ま、どうやったら強くなるか教えていただけますか。So mm. mm. you have fewer ranks. 30. So, um, I'm sure everyone has experience um, oh, of wanting to give up when you keep on losing on online matches. This this is just just not for taken, but any kind of um, sign up for my Medify. So, sign up for it. Like ask them, how <laughs> I will help you. Kind of people become stronger. All right, what what you got? What you got? So this is kind of. So that's it. Kakuto game is not only that. All the other games, no, everyone can't solve it. That's a huge question because whenever you're playing competitively against someone, it's it's something you're always going to face. Ma, so that's it. そうですね。結構難しいんですけど、ま、あの、先ほどの質問で一つ私ちょっと説明し忘れたんですけども、実際そのランクマッチで人に負けて心が折れてしまうっていう体験の前に、えっと、前半戦で紹介したゴーストが
uh, because no matter how uh, intelligent the ghost is going to be, it's still not going to have that split-second decisions of human beings or thinking out of the outside of the box in certain uh, situations. So uh, it's always going to be the case that the human is going to do better competitively. Uh, so you should just have fun with this uh, cool new feature rather than trying to hide your ghost. He said a lot right there. But that definitely means if you beat someone's ghost, that's not a guarantee you're going to beat them. Prepared just in case we wanted to show this. So here is uh, how you uh, fight against the ghost from profile. Oh goodness, think of the content on YouTube. That people are gonna have for free. So for one player's profile, it would include 32 uh, ghost characters, one for each character, right? Think of that. Yeah, think of the YouTube content, guys. I played against Arsla Nash's ghost, and I won. Here is how. Man, one million views. <laughs> Thank you, Arslan. Thank you. You just made me like six thousand dollars. Scenes in FGC, they have unspoken Thank you. Sometimes they're expected to use your main character against your opponent's main character, etc. But if you're fighting their ghost, then you don't have to do that. You can fight with your sub character or whoever you like. They just robbed us of an RDC. Oh well. There's more to be released. Did not look at the character select. I was just thinking about the uh, ghost stuff. I missed it. Jeez. So uh, not only is this a, a good way to just uh, freely fight against other people's ghosts uh, for each of their characters, but it, it, it's also uh, a lower barrier than fighting a human opponent. So it's quite interesting. And uh, can any of you know Yasuda Esports? Uh, he's actually, one of his favorite things to do is during the debugging of this feature, he would, rather than playing against human opponents, just keep uh, downloading ghosts and fighting them. Need my ghosts first, you could talk smack. How to be Arsenal and me at one sitting. Yeah, this is going to be free content. <laughs> it's going to be free content. So although it's fun to fight human opponents, obviously, uh, it is a different type of fun to just uh, go on the on online lobby and look for people who have interesting ghost characters or very strong ghost characters uh, to just have a different way to enjoy the game. He says it's going to be lame content? Yeah, I'm going to do it. <laughs> I'm definitely going to do it. <laughs> I fought against Lil Majin, and I am Lil Majin, who won. Oh, YouTube's going to go crazy. When I keep losing and get frustrated. So I have just the thing, so let me explain about it. Next slide, please. This is My Replay and Tips. Then I do something where I lose on purpose to my ghost, and it's like, oh, this is the new best king player ever. Then I make money off myself, yeah. So just the thing would be uh, my replay and Spoiler tips. alert. This is actually something we had in Tekken 7, but it's been greatly improved for Tekken 8. Uh, what this is is, uh, you know, it, it sucks to lose, but lo losses are very valuable because they give you many hints on what you can do to improve to be a stronger player. Yeah, you get it. Um, is that Skeepus? You got it. You got it. Uh, so now I'm actually going to show you uh, footage of one of my matches in which I lost and how I review it. So this is going to be an updated replay mode from Tekken 7. Okay. Yo, Lily. And for the, sample, the outfit. But, uh, he's playing as Lily. Yo, Asuka. Yo, these outfits are dope. So in this situation, uh, he's already down two rounds, and this would be mean the match if he loses it. 
おそらくこれが最も心が折られる状況だと思いますね。1ラウンドも取れずに負けてしまう。So this is probably the most frustrating instance, right? When you lose three in a row. はい、そんな時どうするかっていうのを次の映像で、えー、解決策をご覧入れますので、次の映像で。No round brown. So what do I do?、Uh, はい、これ先ほどの負け試合のリプレイになります。This is a replay of that、uh, match I just lost. Very interesting. でリプレイで改善すべき点があるとこうやって表示が出てくれて、これは空中コンボもっと高いダメージのコンボが入りますよっていうのを教えてます。Do a <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> Aerial juggle was low powered, and you can do more damage with a more optimized combo. <laughs> you got no damage, so do this 49er. Ah, that's, see, this is what I thought was in Tekken 7. So they actually added it to where you do it right then and there. That's dope. Oh, I got a lot of damage on that one. Bread and butter. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49, though. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do a little bit more than 49. Bread and butter should do But what's really cool is during the replay for 10 seconds, you can actually take control in that particular instance and see if you could have done something better. This is groundbreaking. Yeah, this is, this is groundbreaking. It'll also teach you when you don't do、uh, proper throw escapes, it'll tell you the proper inputs and let you practice right on the spot. Wow, you can actually insert yourself back into the replay and correct your mistakes right there on the fly. That is great. So you're going to know. What to do? That's a great feature. Yeah, that's amazing. That's, that's next level. Yeah. This is next level. Yeah, you can't say you don't know why you lost or, or anything like that anymore. You're going to know exactly how. And you're going to know exactly what to do. So you all you have to pre order right away, right? <laughs> We're going to feel bad when we like re watch this stuff and it's like we dropped a combo. It's going to say, yo, do this combo. <laughs> you know, this combo would have actually worked. Like, man, go to the next slide. <laughs> <laughs> Man, don't tell me that. I know I dropped the combo. And so,、uh, although this is the, the more improved version for Tekken 8, if you want to try it right away today, you can actually、uh, experience it in Tekken 7. There, there's the predecessor of this mode in that game. Uh, and also, we'd like to add that not only gives,、uh, you can do replays of、uh, matches with human opponents, but you can also do this mode with、uh, replays of fights against ghosts as well. So you can fight someone's ghost, and if you lose,、uh, review and improve here. Hi, now, the most cast are each of the more Taijin saying at the Koto Naiko, the Mechakcha Umai to Katsio. That's called, that's called being down bad. So with Tekken 8, we might the ghosts whoop you so good, you got to go to replay, correct the mistakes. But that's good, though. It's good. Don't let me deter you. Do it. Say, turn it up a little bit. 
not only will we play in tips, uh, show you what you did wrong and, and what to improve, but you can let me see, see let me what see. your opponent could have done better in their uh, action as well. And it helps you just get more insight into their characteristics and their tendencies. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. You're down bad for high ranks. You want to get higher than red ranks this time? You got it, bro. There are fewer ranks. So we actually put a lot of uh, resources into this mode, and we're really excited and proud of it. Yo, Grand Kataro, I'm going to hear that plenty. <laughs> and I'm definitely going to see it on YouTube. Grand was just saying it's, uh, it was very expensive, by the way. <laughs> で、ま、ここあの、本当に Say you okay, okay. And that's my <笑>ありがとうございます。もう、すごくなれる要素がたくさんあったマイリプレンチ。いっぱいあるけれども、ま、強くなる方法は教えていただけましたが、ま、そもそもこういったマイリプレンチチップスで学んだことを使って、もう
Tekken, is the enjoyable part is the aerial combos. So you'll want to go learn those next. Next movie, please. はい、こちらのレシピだったり、タイミングを音で判断することで、より、で、テクン7。で、ファイクスモードルックスアラットバッター。ま、ここではえっと、コンボのレシピだったり、タイミングを音で判断することで、より、で、テクン7。で、ファ
there's so many different uh, elements, right? So you can save a certain situation as you like. はい、これの使い方も映像がありますので、ご覧ください。いや、いや、これ and then restart from that instance to find different combo recipes. Wow. Beginners rejoice. Wow. Extremely useful. Everyone rejoice. Perhaps you'll want to be in a certain angle to the wall and your opponent. Oh yes, this stuff here. Practice that situation. Side wall practice. はい、最後はまあよくある下段さばき後にあ、手癖でやっちゃったみたいなところの改善点どうしたらいいかっていうのは練習です。Or perhaps uh, for a low parry, maybe you're not doing the most optimized action. So you can uh, practice this just from starting from the low parry. No wonder why this game is going to be 100 gigabytes. In this particular instance, we're starting from a low parry, and we want to carry them to the wall and do the rage art. So we've saved that particular situation. Wow. Someone would make that already, but uh, it's wow. great to have it now for Tekken 8. なんで本当に筋トレのジムじゃないですけど、鍛えたい部位ごとにいろんな練習をしてあのパーフェクトなあのプレイヤーを目指してください。So it's almost like going to the gym to be a bodybuilder. In this manner, you can uh, kind of strengthen the various areas of your game to become a more well-rounded player. Wow, everyone's gonna be godlike in this game. If they really want to be, yeah. And there's nothing stopping you now. あとこのたくさんの練習方法でちょっとねご覧になってる皆さんの中で鉄拳8とこれからやるって方もだんだん自信がついてきたかと思うんですけれどもまあおそらく自信がついてくると鉄拳8を1早く試したいと思うと思う
But we just want to reiterate that uh, when the game is actually released, there'll be over 30 characters. Uh, so please look forward to that. 32. 32. 32. 32. So 32 characters in the retail version. ということはここでクロースベータテストのお話が出たということは実際にクロースベータテストバージョンでプレイしているところを今日見せていただけるということでしょうか。So you mentioned close beta test version. That would be nice if they did have an open one. Showing us the actual what being played, the CBT being played today. そうですね。はい。もうあの特別にビルドを持ってきましたので。新キャラクターだったり、ちょっとみんな見てみたいであの動きだったり、ペンの動きとかをあの実際実機で対戦しながら、そういうのも交えてお見せしたいと思います。Yeah, that's a lot. We have the actual same build as the closed beta test, and so we'll be showing off some of the battle between two of the new characters. We assume everyone will want to see. As Usena, and also I don't remember to take a seven base roster. Showing a bit of how to use the special style during the battles. Remember, taking seven did have vanilla, but it was definitely less than 32. So let's check out this battle between Nakatsu and Harada. Yeah, because this game isn't having an arcade release, so yeah. You may as well call the, <laughs> the console release, what, vanilla? Before they start all the patching and seasons and all that. Harada's about to wash this guy. Yeah, the director has no chance. Yeah, I mean, he's going to have this. This ridiculous fang way. Yeah, Harada's about to. He's about to wash. Unless he said, <laughs> You beat me, you're fired. <laughs> no, no, nah, nah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> don't you embarrass me in front of all these folks. <laughs> Yo, this is much faster, guys. You notice this? Look how quick the characters load up. That's a lot faster than the, the closed network test. Oh, we got the presets. Yo, she's in a bikini already. Oh, the drip! Yo, Fang Wei! Look at that red suit! Please pick the red suit, Harada, please. And Nakatsu will be playing against Harada, and as you see, there's actually customization presets to choose. Harada, come on. Oh well. That is, that is dripped out Fang Wei. Which is brand new for CBT, based on Machu Picchu. Let's start. Ortiz Farm. Get ready for the next battle. Yeah, Harada's about to wash. Yo, that is such a dope outfit she has. Of course, you can skip the intro if you want to. Harada's using a special style. Okay, they both are. You can switch between special style at any time, on or off. Harada's going with special style on. You saw that? The one button throw? One button down, back three. Yeah, this is the future of Tekken. I'm gonna be using it too. Yo, director with these combos. So what's cool about special style is it optimizes the combo depending on the situation, whether you have heat, state, rage, etc. Oh, 
<laughs> Cheesy. So they still launches. But it's an instant tail flip. Okay. One button, one two. It's actually different than uh, so, and you can see it's changed from the CNT because uh, for the uh, square button and uh, for the cross, uh, you can actually now do directional inputs along with it to get different variations of the special moves or lower attacks. That is something else. So it's even easier than before to check out special style. So we hope you'll try it out in uh, closed beta test. Of course it tracks. Of course the jumping AOE stump tracks. Of course it does. Okay, director has to win now. You see the breakable aspects of the stage, and would you continue to go deeper uh, to lower? Why that low didn't even hit him? That is really something. I don't know what to say about the specialty style. And you can see Az Azusan is using a special stance which allows her to automatically dodge uh, high attacks. So she's quite uh, fun to play. Okay. He just mashed triangle, he got that. So the triangle button is Lots of damage. So just uh, when you're in the, when you have a rage available, just pushing the triangle button in quick succession. Uh, Bang way. Uh, I like it. And if you finish your opponents, uh, they have little remaining health. If you finish them with that, uh, it goes into a kind of a, a cool little intro with a coffee CM a commercial. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> that dodge. <laughs> wow. Bro, he smashes hurt. All right. Harada finishes his plate. So as you can see, by using special style, it lets you pick up any character and quickly be able to play. That is crazy. One more? Ah, one more. Okay, one more. So you have the one button special moves. Yeah, so you have the one button special moves. Yeah, so you have the one button special moves. This is going to make talking about the game a lot more difficult. I told Nakata he should actually go for it. Yeah, you're actually going to walk up to someone and ask them, like, how do you do that low you were just killing me with? I was just hitting four. So now we want to show you uh, <laughs> much, uh, what's the actual so command. I don't know. I just hit four. <laughs> I play specialty style, bro. Maybe for people who are new to Tekken, it's get with the times, old man. So we'll help you find a character you think looks cool and then check out. Yeah, the future is now, old man. So I'm only pressing triangle repetitively. That is going to be crazy. Because you know, like, 
pro players are gonna use this to um definitely like one button launchers that are hard to do and then finish the rest of the combo the real way because i'm telling you if machine must have one button electric that's gonna be ridiculous May charge you can also do just with one single button press. I'm I'm looking at Kazuya's um buttons over here. Oh it is a one button electric! No! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. かなり前のテストの時よりも多彩な技が出せるそうですねよりあのいろんな技を出したいっていうご意見だったりもっと駆け引きを充実したいっていうような意見があったので調整しました。So you can see that there are a lot more moves are available now in the special style. Uh, this was actually due to player feedback and they wanted more options uh, in the back and forth with their opponent. For example, you can simply do just a low attack quite easily and then follow it up with a mid. Uh, Unseeable uh, hail sweep. Uh, mix up your opponent, which is a, a typical character. Oh my goodness. We can all do electrics now. Bro, they just deleted the... Um, the execution barrier <laughs> for Kazuya. Wow. Ooh. Wow. That's dope. And disrespectful. You can see that in this time, uh, actually the character's clothing and the face, etc., uh, gets dirtied when they actually are down by their opponent. There were some startup frames on um, like King's 4-4 Neutral 2 when I hit the circle button. It wasn't like instant. But those electrics looked instant. Yeah, that looks instant. Like as soon as he hits the button. You might have, uh, Look at all the dirt on his face. CNT, uh, the heat first now have a Look at the dirt on his collar. This could be the best Tekken ever, guys. So, uh, and that's it for the uh, footage of the actual online battle. Uh, we hope that some of the stuff that we've been uh, tell telling you guys about today, you were able to see it from the actual battle between the two. So if you're excited to play the game right away, uh, please apply for the CBT. Wow. You said, well, the worst ever? Nah, it's going to be the best. It's, it's, it's the best. So Sally, it is now time to wrap up today's fruitful talk session. But before we finish, I'd like to ask a word from each of our Tekken members. Do whatever it takes. <laughs> Experience. This game is great. これでも足りないぐらい実はいろんな要素が入ってますので、何よりもパッケージで買って so uh, we've been talking for two hours already, but we still uh, have stuff we weren't able to talk about today. Uh, so the game is uh, actually going to be amazing, not only to play by yourself, but online against other people. Yeah, so this is looking like the best tech in ever. You, you should uh, go ahead and pre-order today. Be you might have noticed we have like the accessibility the there's also different editions is it's never like before TV. seen so with Tekken as as yeah this is yeah this is gonna be great 
はい、本当、えー、2時間あっという間でしたけども、えー、とこういった機会を設けていただいて、本当感謝しています。で開発メンバーも今回、とんでもないボリュームかつ CNT, beta, の技術も高くあの最高の鉄拳を yeah, yeah.、えー、お送りしようと日々開発頑張ってます。<笑>で、まあ、今回、その会場に来てくれた開発メンバーもいますが、まあ、忙しくて来れなかった人も今、頑張ってくれてるんで、あのー、きっと魅力は今回の配信でしっかり伝えられたかなと思います。I agree, life will change. 期待していただいても、絶対裏切らない出来になっていると思うんで、えー、今日会場に来てくれた人や配信を見てくれた方でちょっとでも面白そうだなと思ったら、That was really good. ありがとうございます。今日はありがとうございます。今日はありがとうございます。今日はありがとうございます。今日はありがとうございます。今日はありがとうございます。今日はありがとうございます。But many of them are back at the office、uh, continually working to improve the game. What up, Jim、so, Blake?、Uh, whether it's you know, the volume of Tekken 8 or whether it's the high level quality of all the components we created,、uh, we're quite confident that it's an excellent package. So, even no matter how excited you are about the game,、uh, if you purchase it, we're sure that you're going to enjoy it. So, we can't wait for you to have your hands on it. えっと、こうやって日本の場でこうプレゼンするのはあまりないからなかなか新鮮な感じではありますで今回あのお二人も言ったんですけどなかなかいろんな話ができたんですけど実際自分で遊ぶと全然違うので僕もあのもう仕事は yeah, this is gonna be the best ゲームだとよくするんですけどもうあっという間に時間経ってもう遊び足りない,い yeah, I'm, I'm kind of sold with that opinion guys cause yeah that practice mode So,、uh, you guys know I live in practice mode.、Uh, it's quite interesting to be here. Yeah. That, and that replay where you can like, do that stuff right then and there.、Uh, also, like we、correct saying, your mistakes.、Uh, so、many cool features about Tekken 8.、Uh, it's hard to Now, I don't know about the one button electrics. But, uh, <laughs> but other than that. Yeah. And I always want to play more. So, now、nah, they, they, were, they, they weren't playing for real, Shin Blade. They, was, they were just trying to show you guys,、uh, well, they were trying to show us. They were trying to show us. What's up? Everybody pre ordered already. Do you want to get here? Harada san, Michael san, Ikara san, Honjitsa, Hontoni, Arigato, Ozai, Mr. Thank you very much for coming, Mr. Harada, Michael, and Ikara san. Yeah, this was a, this was a great show. That practice mode, that, that sold me. Practice mode and the ghost battle. Yeah, that was great. Now it's time for exciting announcements. Oh, they got Jin now. Okay. Because they, they showed King a while back, but yeah, Jin too. These cool figures displayed here are Jin and King from Game Dimensions, taken from Bandai. Game Dimensions is a game scene of the game 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 of The characters are sculpted to look like they were taken straight. It's supposed to be power, but I don't, I don't know. With a total of 20 plus articulation points, <laughs> he's on the cupcake. Each figure they should have colored it orange. Hands, character specific yeah, I don't know about parts, that clear color. Accessories and 20, point, 20 plus points of articulation to pose and play in endless ways. Game、the、dimensions. The SRP is $26.99. Yeah, good old 27 bucks. Let's take a look at each of these two figures. No trailer? Actually, this info dump was better than a character trailer. What you guys think of the chat? Now, I do agree. Yo, who is that?、Um, Josedo? I think that yesterday we should have gotten a panda trailer for sure. I'm like, why didn't we get that at least if we were going to get a statue? And them trolling us with the little panda mask. Yeah, we should have got a panda trailer. 
Jin includes but that was yesterday. But today, round two, round like this information this dump was um, great. And the footage they showed us with the practice mode, ghost battle, arcade, that, you know, battle hub, all that stuff was great. So, um, yeah, this was a great show. Lots and lots of good content here. Next up is King. King Five long months. Max mask has been reproduced in great detail using a special. It's not going to be that long though. We got we, yo. It's really four months. Fight round plate. It is scheduled to be released April 2024. Game Dimensions is an incredibly detailed figure series with ultra articulations for the You want to know, can you tell if someone is playing the special style? It's on the screen. Yeah, it actually shows up on the screen. I'll take the king one if they send this Shin Blade. <laughs> big announcement. Ling Xiaoyu from Tekken 8 will be joining the Nandroid Chibi figure Yeah, they're done with Tekken 7. They're like, okay, Akuma can win the TWT again. It's all good. どんな表情パーツやオプションパーツが付属されるか続報をどうぞお楽しみに。On Steam it requires 100 gigabytes. And arm and leg parts, various poses and scenes from the game can be recreated. I believe I still have the game. Yeah. Yeah, I still have it. ここでもう一つお知らせですが、なんと東京ゲームショウの会場にて。I'm at the clean my um, hard drive of all these uh, YouTube videos also, the that I already uploaded. I need to delete them all. At the Tokyo Game Show, so please be sure to stop by the Bandai Namco Entertainment booth and check it out. Yeah, I only got two terabytes. さあさあさあ続きましてバンダイスピリッツよりアクションフィギュアシリーズ <laughs> Bandai Spirits will release Jin Kazama in the SH Figure Arts action That's figure such a series. cool outfit, right? SH Figure Arts wa kado nioru character hyogen no tsuikyu o tema ni zouke, kado, saishiki no gijutsu o gyoushuku shita tenohira size no standard hour <laughs> SH Figure Arts captures a charm I'll get it and advertise it detail sculpting an unparalleled range of motion and series accurate coloring Yeah, 27 Compass bucks everything down to a standard not bad, not bad. Sides. You need to buy Nas or Das for video storage? What is that? to further information. さらにさらに本日はブース内に参考展示として試作品を初公開しておりますのでぜひご覧になってください。also, the actual figure is on display for the first time today in the booth, so please be sure to take a look. Nars or Das? Okay. Nars or Das? Fighting Stick Alpha collaboration product. Yeah, but I could, I could always just clean up stuff. I can clean up the extra stuff. I think I still have two, at least two terabytes free. Yo, that's a clean stick. That's a very cool fight stick. I don't need another. <laughs> I don't need another. I have like four of them. The products come with Even though that looks dope, though. Original top panel artwork with Tekken 8 designs, so you can enjoy your own unique design. The product is scheduled to be released in January 2024. Tenban Design Dado no Shosai wa Gojitsu Kokai Yote. Say pause. Yeah, yeah, pause. Pause. Yeah, I'm not very good at that stuff. That's the Shin Blade special. <laughs> the pause and stuff. 
Details for the top panel. Yeah, and I ain't, I ain't very good at it. Date, so please stay tuned for more information. Yeah, I use a pad. The yeah. new fighting stick alpha is used at the Tekken booth, so please be sure to check it out. You said your Call of Duty is 175. Wow. So, the Tokyo Game Show is a great display of the game. Yeah, that was a, that was a great display of the game. And the, the modes of practice and all that stuff. That was very enjoyable. Now, those, like I said, the one button electrics. Said that's a clean. <laughs> uh, you going to PS5 pad or stick with PS4? I'm going to have to buy a converter because I might need to, um, I don't know, because those PS5 pads are good. It's just that they can, you know, wear out on you quick. So, um, yeah, yeah, PlayStation 4 pads last longer. The PS5 pass, yeah. No, no pause. There's too much to keep up with other graphics. I ain't gonna keep pausing. Yo, K Hex, yo, Spiro Jam would say PlayStation 1 was the GO as far as controllers. What's up, ASAP Marco? He said it lasts longer if you don't suplex them, shoot, or try to, you know, execute giant swings all day. Yeah, you know, I played King and Armor King, and yeah, that, that PS5 pad did not last. Man, I missed that sale. Jeez. That marks the closing of Tekken Talk Live at TGS 2023. Thank you all very much for coming. Well, that Thank was you good. That was good. Thanks for tuning in online, and we'll see you on very soon. That was actually a good show. Boo, they ass. Home. What is Shin Blade not? Yo, what? <laughs> Yo, some people you cannot please, right? <laughs> Yo, my goodness. <laughs> I had to, I had to mute that because he, <laughs> wow, <laughs> that, that was funny. I actually want to see, hold up. This is Rod Hayden, Rod yeah, ain't no way. How can I get better? Turn the game off. That's crazy. I... Just turn the game off. We're definitely going to raid Shinblade yeah, because of this. Because I want to see. I'm finna get out though, y'all. I'm missing the final stream. That's how you know we up too long. <laughs> <laughs> you know We're actually gonna do it before he <laughs> gets off Ain't here. No Memphis stop streaming. Soon as I get. I'm gonna get off and raid me though. Better hurry up. Mm. No, I'm gonna tell him to raid foot slap. Oh yeah, foot slap gonna be on forever. Look at no. No, look at my dog. Don't wait me, bro. I told you. I no. 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 Don't do it! <laughs>
<laughs> Look at that promise. Don't do it. Yo. 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 Somebody clip it. Clip it. Yeah. <laughs>